please subscribe. Do remember, if you wish to open a trading account, check out my Webo link below. You'll get four free stocks whenever you sign up. Minimum deposit required, $100. Also, pre-market hours trading starts at 4 a.m. sharp. 4 a.m. sharp with Webo. Webo loan it. Way to go. Good afternoon, ladies and gentlemen, and welcome back to the channel. My name's Dave Natch. I speak stocks. Welcome back to another episode of Sunday Stalkless. Today is Sunday, September 19th. In today's video, I have two plays for you to put on stock this coming week. Let me delve right into the plays. The first stock is PRTH. PRTH closed up 47% on Friday at $7.45 pennies. Uh, the company acquired Fing Fing Sarah. Go ahead and read up the news on your own time. Is this the right synergy for PRTH? Only time will tell. This one is in the IT services industry. Okay, let's kick the tires. They were a market cap of 505. I'm sorry, 515 million in market cap. They have 8 million in the float. 86% of the float are held by insiders. Let me repeat that. 86% of the float are held by insiders. This is PRTH. 7% are held by institution and shorts as 1% of the float. Their 200 day moving average is 6.81. Okay. If this one retracts below 7 bucks, that's your buy point in the low six to mid six that would be a fair entry in my opinion prth watch for an opportunity this week wait for a pullback let's continue their profit margin is up six percent their operating margin is a positive seven percent their roa is 4.22 percent they have 453 million in revenues okay their revenue per share is 6.68, 6.68, okay? Their quarterly revenue growth is up 35% year over year. Their gross profit is 127 million. Their EBITDA is 65 million. Watch for this number to increase because of the merger, okay? Also, Pay attention to their revenues. Their revenue is going to be rosier since the acquisition, okay? Their, their revenue and their EBITDA. Pay attention. <laughs> their net income is $13 million. Total cash, $11 million. Total debt, $321 million. This is PRTH. I got to check out their current ratio. Okay, bear in mind these numbers are going to change for the better because of the uh, acquisition, hopefully for the better. Okay, please sit tight for stock number two to put on stock this coming week. Don't forget to hit like, don't forget to subscribe to the channel. Around here we find supernova movers early. Dave's play is the place to be. Sit tight. So the purpose of the stock list is for you to do your due diligence on the stock, check out their historicals, check out their news, research the CEO, okay? And uh, wait for an opportunity to pounce this week. Stock number two to put on start this week is SCWX. SCWX closed up 13% on Friday at $25 and 98 cents 
this one has a sexy five day chart also they're breaking out to new new five year highs new five year highs the volume on friday was 700k compared to the average volume of 100k scwx okay this one is in the software space let's get the tires they wear a market cap of 2.22 billion note before just want to mention this the stock is making the stock made nine consecutive higher lows nine consecutive higher lows also they made seven consecutive higher highs this one is moving rapidly okay let's continue they have 12 million in the float 18 percent of the float are held by insiders 68 percent of the float are held by institutions and in short says three percent of the float this is scwx their revenue is 555 million revenue per share is 6.77 their gross profit 319 million they have 197 million in cash and 27 i'm sorry 26 million in debt bringing them to a current ratio of 1.20 okay their operating cash flow is a positive 41 million their leverage free cash flow is a positive 42 million this is scwx that's all i have for you ladies and gentlemen get back to your sunday's activity and pardon the interruption just want to do a quick video of a couple of stickers that i saw might be moving this coming week okay I'll see you tomorrow with Dave's Play. Do not forget to set your notification for my upload. I usually upload between 7 a.m. and 8.30 a.m., okay? I'm up 3.30 a.m. to research my plays and also trade. Trading starts at 4 a.m. with Weeble. Weeble only, okay? Sign up with the link below if necessary. Also, check out my Robinhood link if necessary check the description box i'll see you tomorrow with the plays dave natch i'm out boom bam make your next trade your best trade One point eight three percent at one hundred and forty six dollars and six pennies. Apple. Let's delve right into Dave's play. Dave's play yesterday was CRVS. CRVS closed up one hundred and thirty five percent at five dollars and thirty two cents. The stock opened up at three seventy nine, spiked as high as five eighty. That's a brand new fifty two week high. 580 the low on the day 357 three dollars and 57 cents the volume yesterday was a whopping 200 
I thank you for watching. Dave Natch, I'm out. HLBZ. This one closed up 96% at 1769 on partnership news. Go ahead and follow me on Twitter at Dupitit. Okay. The stock opened up at 1789. Spite as high as 2575. Okay. And the low on the day, 1528. HLBZ. The volume yesterday was 68 million. Compare and contrast to their average volume. Got a lot of money invested in a DF play. Every day, you want your money at? Subscribe to DF Notch. Foot full gas rich. Yeah, this is Danny B. the Jingle King. I've only got argument for Guno. I've only got argument for Guno. But you know, I'm find myself with the money. And instead, I'm squander it and go on with foolishness and go along with. You want your money at? Subscribe. To Dave Natch, please me I tell you no. Go on, go make the money now, please. Yeah man, wanna do it fast and quick here. Subscribe to Dave Natch. Fast, don't stop. Every day, you want the money go, check Dave's play. Invest. Interest. Bless.